Hello, this is David Hale with Tech Dive TV. Welcome to episode 33 of Tech Dive TV Help Desk. In today's episode, we're talking about a scam. Now, it's not a new scam, but it's something that has grown quite a bit in recent days. Even I've been, you know, attempted to be fooled, but it's not going to work. What happens is you'll receive a phone call from either Microsoft, supposedly, the Windows Service Bureau, or Microsoft Windows. Um, first of all, Microsoft does not call you. Uh, there is no such thing as the Windows Service Bureau, and you're not going to be called by Microsoft Windows. Most of these people have accents, meaning they're probably not from the United States. They're calling from a foreign uh, country. Uh, also, they spoof the phone number, so you can't call it back. Uh, what they're trying to do is tell you that your computer is downloading uh, bad software or malware or viruses or um, corrupt software um, from your internet connection. Now, first of all, they have no idea what your computer is doing. They can't tell if you're downloading bad software or not. They have no window into your computer, so to speak. What they're trying to do is get you to pay a fee, usually around $150, for them to come in, take control of your computer, and clear out this corrupt software. What they're actually doing is planting corrupt software, making it look like they're fixing your computer, and your computer's fine after they're done because they really haven't done anything. Then, because they have access to your computer, they can gain access anytime they want to. That's the way they set it up. Then they activate the malware that they put on your computer later on and call you back and say, oh, we've detected more malware. Would you like us to fix it? Oh, of course, fix it. Well, they'll charge you another $150. It's a scam. Don't believe it. People don't call you to tell you you're downloading bad things. They don't know what you're doing. Um, I had a call of this nature a few days ago. And I asked them, which of my 17 computers has bad software? And they said, oh, uh, hmm, are all of your computers on the same internet connection? I said, no. No, I have seven different internet connections from three different providers. So I'd like to know which computers are the ones that are you know, being affected. Uh, it kind of set her back a little bit, the woman on the phone. She didn't know, quite know what to say. So I asked her, what IP address is the malware being transmitted to? She didn't know that either, and she hung up. Hmm, isn't that interesting? So if someone calls you and says they're calling from Windows Service Bureau or Microsoft or Microsoft Windows or anything else, saying that your computer is downloading bad software, hang up on them. You could even report them to the Better Business Bureau or the Federal Trade Commission. Not that it would do much good because they're probably outside the country but don't fall for it. If you need help with your computer, go to our local computer store. They'll help you. This is David Hale with Tech Dive TV and Tech Dive TV Help Desk. Have a great day.